what up guys, Two Nako here. Today, more The Division. We take a look on the high-end assault rifle Caduceus. 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 Oh, okay, thanks. I hope you enjoy the video. The high-end weapon Caduceus is a legendary assault rifle based on the SCAR, which stands for Special Operation Forces Combat Assault Rifle. Wow, rolls right out of your tongue. An assault rifle developed by FN Hursta. Hursta is also known for the famous Finfall or FN Fall. The Caduceus was one of the few high-end weapons in the Division beta and was only available at the Dark Zone safe room vendor for like, I think, 3000 Dark Zone credits. Unlike the beta, this weapon can't be simply bought off a vendor or be crafted. Not only drops off level 30 plus enemies in the Dark Zone or random from any challenge mode missions. Some people out there say that they got like a drop from like level 25 enemies in the PvE zone, but I've never, never seen a legendary drop of level 25 enemies, so um, I don't know. Maybe we are lucky in Xurs, I mean the special weapon vendor is going to sell it soon, who knows. Okay, now it's time to take a closer look on the perks talents of the Caduceus. Talent 1, cool headed. Performing a headshot reduces all skill cooldowns by 5%. Talent 2. Restored. Killing a target with this weapon removes all negative status effects. And the unique talent? Self-preserved. Critical hits with this weapon heal the user for 3% of the damage dealt. The Caduceus can take 4 out of 5 mod slots as it cannot be painted, instead coming with a standard bright blue, gold and blackish color scheme. In conclusion, I think the Caduceus is a pretty good assault rifle in which the cool headed talent particularly stands out. With the right character build I think this gun can get close to a Midas. There is a lot going on on the official forums and on reddit about those builds and they are said to be extremely powerful. The horizontal stability on this weapon is a pain in the ass though. I highly recommend to add some stability mods plus a high capacity mag. As for the optics, I think an ACOG 4 is probably the best choice for this weapon. The ACOG boosts the range and stability significantly on the Caduceus and Caduceus Caduceus Caduce fuck this name and makes it easier for you to land some headshots on your enemies. Guys. Please guys, use the comment section below and tell us what you think of the high-end weapon Caduceus. Caduceus. Ca Caduceus. Thanks, Emma. That's it for today, guys. Thanks a lot for watching, and as always, like if you like, dislike if you don't like the shit, and feel free to subscribe to our channel for more awesome The Division and Gaming stuff. See you next time.